This is a video app review of TuneIn Radio, brought to you by the developer TuneIn, previously known as Radio Time. Version 1.2 was used for this review. TuneIn Radio is one of the premier radio apps available today on the marketplace, and is completely free. It's also available on just about every other phone OS out there, as well as Google TV, Yahoo TV, the Roku box, and the WD TV box. And you can also stream on their website. So it does run the gamut, and if you create a login, all your presets are savable throughout all the different phones and TV systems. Very convenient. <clears throat> Interestingly, the app design seems to resemble the core design of each phone OS. If you were to load this up on the iPhone, it looks very iPhone-ish, and on Android, it looks Android-ish. I just made those words up. Uh, for Windows Phone 7, it's very simple. Black background, simple white text. Uh, there is a little bit of a Metro interface once you get into the streaming section, but for the most part, it's, it's plain and simple. You're going to be able to choose the categories right here. You can search, type in the name of a station, type in the name of a, even of a podcast, which is very convenient. And then here's all your categories. You can search by location and also by language. If I go to, oh, if you go to local radio, you do have the option to actually listen to your local stations through FM, saving you bandwidth. Very convenient. It does work, and if you are getting bad FM signal, you can just click a button and voila, you're streaming instead. So if I go to my presets, and let's see what it looks like. We'll go to 98.9 The Bear. Sports tickets and much more by playing live trivia every figures Thursday that uh, <laughs> figures that we would be on a commercial right now so we're not going to see the album art or uh, hear the music but as you can see it was quick to load here you can remove it or add it to your presets if you swipe over you're going to get related um, stations a lot of them are uh, online only stations you can choose a stream, report a problem, and uh, let them know there's something wrong with your station to fix it. Fortunately, there's no section to request a station if it's not in the list. But uh, hopefully they'll add that in the near future. You can click home right here. And uh, I wanted to show you what it looks like to go by location. I'm really amazed by just the sheer amount of radio stations. They're saying over 50,000. And I can, I can definitely see why that's possible. If we go to Europe... Swipe all the way down to the bottom to the UK. And uh, go to London. I think you'll be amazed just but in London how many are there. It was, I think I counted 50 plus. And they do have uh, BBC stations. Um, it's just, and some of them are streaming out of London, but most of them are actual radio stations that have stream online options. So really, I mean, I checked out Mexico City, I checked out several different uh, continents, and it's, it seems like it's almost all there. All right, let's uh, go to the settings page, because that's really important. Uh, some really great settings here. Uh, one basic setting is to enable the radio playback when the screen is locked. That's pretty standard. But what isn't standard is to the ability to disable the auto lock for now playing. So let's say you're on a road trip, and you're streaming a station, and you've got it mounted to your truck dashboard or whatever, it's going to stay on, you're going to see your album art, and uh, it's just very convenient. I hate having to tap on the screen every four minutes or so before the screen times out on me. You can. Uh, this is where you can allow the FM tuner to be used for local stations, which is also used in combination with your GPS to figure out what your local stations are. Very convenient, it works just fine, I was able to switch between FM and streaming. Alright, uh, also, I want to show you, as you can see, you can see the clock here, clicking up brings you your information bar. Very convenient. I wish all apps would allow this so that you can see uh, what you need to see. And if the phone was charging, you would have a charging symbol on, on the screen at all times as well. Very convenient feature. Much appreciated. Let's go to the bottom line. Uh, really an amazing number of local radio stations and growing for almost all locations worldwide. The option to use the FM signal for local stations is great, saves you some bandwidth. The information bar is a great addition. Syncing your presets throughout all your devices, very handy. Podcast streaming support works just fine. Not all podcasts are supported in gadgets there, but um, this is my next podcast, which is the uh, Josh Topolsky and a lot of the guys from Engadget. They're, uh, they're not on here just yet. Uh, 
and no advertisements as you can see for a free app that's awesome the option to disable the screen timeout is also much appreciated just a few negatives um, no you can't play the music in the background why well it's not their fault it's still windows phone 7 limitation mango will fix it be patient and i'm sure this app will be updated it doesn't metro, it doesn't utilize the metro interface as much as it could but once you're within the station uh, there are, is a metro interface there uh, the playback error message does pop up for me every once in a while. This is new. I don't know if it's just certain stations having problems, but I have gotten a few playback errors. Um, and if I kept pressing play, it would eventually go away and the, the station would play. There's no radio, quest, uh, no radio station request option available just yet. Um, there is an app called Radio Hub, which I will be covering in the near future, that actually allows you to request a station. And as I'll be covering, uh, they got a station for me within an hour that was not on the system. I'm going to give this a 9 out of 10. There's just very little uh, negative about this. It's, it's very close to a 10 out of 10. Once we get Mango, this is easily going to make a 10 out of 10. Great free app. Check it out and enjoy. This has been a video app review of TuneIn Radio. WM Power User.